Hey to all of you talented video creators! Today we'll show you how to imitate a VHS rewind effect. It looks really really cool, helps maintain the attention of your viewers and it's also quite easy to replicate. Let's see how it's done. Create a project and import your video. Duplicate the video file and place both copies on the same layer, one after another. Now make a click on the duplicate and use the following settings. Playing backwards, yes. Speed, 1000. Go back to the first video and cut off the last 5-10 seconds of it. Then move the remaining part, which is the beginning of the video, to the end of the sequence. Just like that. Select all the files and convert them into a sprite. Then set the following parameters. Use this container, no. Show effects, yes. Feel background? No. Make a double click on the sprite to open it and apply the glitch effect to the piece that is playing backwards. Select any glitch preset to your taste, but remember that the image shouldn't be completely covered with visual noise. You might also want to add a piece of text that's usually used during rewinding in VHS. For instance, you can put something like REW that stands for Rewind Video. We also recommend using a different color theme for the part that plays backwards. You can do it by applying any quick style from the gallery. And that's it! Fast and easy! Did you like the tutorial? We're about to share more awesome video effects you can apply for free in VSDC. So hit that subscribe button.